Okay, can you see everybody? Yes, we're recording. Are you ready? Ready. We're on. Yay. Okay, Hi. I'm excited to do this. I'm so excited. This is so fun. Uh, thanks for having me here, you guys. I'm excited to do this. And my name is Bethany. I think I met, I think I met everybody now. And Jackie, I'm excited to get her started in her R Bond business. <laughs> I feel a little self-conscious knowing that I'm 72 inches right now, but <laughs> that's all right. It's all good. Okay. So Jackie, before we get started, I want I thought um, it'd be nice to hear from you for a minute. What made you decide to jump in? Because I think it's a big deal. People want to know, or maybe they already know, but if you want to share for just a minute. Well, you made me jump in, Bethany. I did. I did. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you kind of did. Uh, I met Bethany a while back. I know you, you guys probably know this story, but I met Bethany a while back at the, at the restaurant. She came up to me and talked to me about Arbonne. And I was like, oh, yeah, I know Arbonne. But anyway, she, we started to do it then, and I love the products. They're all safe. They're botanical. They're everything that I liked in a product. But the company was even the better deal because you – were so generously compensated for what you did. And there's, I love doing these little things like this. And can you get to meet people and see people and make relationships and stuff like that? But, um, and I really love that. I absolutely love that. Bethany and I were both at the same level of management a few years ago when we did this together. And I got pregnant and lost my district. And Bethany got pregnant and probably lost her dish. Oh, no, you maintained yours, didn't you? Oh, for like three years, but then I eventually lost it. <laughs> yeah. And then, um, but uh, anywho, uh, get back in it. Fast forward seven years or so, it, my husband got sick and lost his job. And uh, we've been struggling financially for, and, and waiting to see if we we're going to hear good news from the doctors to give them a good bill of health to go back to work. And, He's, it's over a year now, and he's doing a little part-time work here and there as much as he can. So Bethany contacted me, of, of, I don't know, about seven months ago and said, Jackie, I really think you need to look at this. I know you need to stay home with your kids and with your husband and, and do your things at home. She goes, but I got to tell you, I just made the biggest paycheck in our barn. <laughs> <laughs> and, yeah. and she told me that she made it to region, which is a regional vice president, which is the third level of management. And she said that to me, and then I about cried because I was trying to, I needed to hear something that was going to be something that I could do again. So, fast forward six months, and I decided Michael got a clean bill of, well, a sort of clean bill, he's not dying, let's put it that way. <laughs> he's afflicted, but not dying. <laughs> not able to hold a job yet. So I'm just going to fast forward with that and get to a level of management in Arbonne to get to, to go ahead and supplement the income that I need to, we can comfortably pay our bills instead of having to sell things off in the house to bring money in to pay bills, which that's what we've gotten down to. <laughs> um, and the other thing is that um, I appreciate you guys coming on and supporting me. It really means a lot to me. It really does. And I know this may not be something that, or maybe maybe something that you guys would like to investigate, but you guys have friends too that I'd really like to get to know also because you don't know if it would be for them. You know, so that's what I'm looking for. That's what I'm looking for. So, and then Bethany, later on, I'm sure she's going to show you something really <laughs> kick ass. <laughs> Aren't you? And you're recording this and I just cussed. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Keeping it real. Okay. Can you, can you edit that? <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you, Bethany, for doing this for me. And and sharing Arvon again with me and able to give me insight and some relief knowing that I can control my finances. Yes. Yay. Thank okay. you for sharing. You're welcome. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to record too. So there it is. It's back to you. Okay. Well, I have to tell you that I, um, yeah, Jackie hit the nail on the head. I, I signed up as a consultant 11 years ago. 
I'll just tell you really quickly that whole scenario. I only did it because I wanted the products at a discount. Basically, I tried a sample package. I knew I wanted the products, but I never pay full price for anything. So I, you know, I was like, okay, I want this. What's the best deal I can get? And so literally at that time, my, my only option was either a consultant or buy retail as a client. I'm like, I'm not paying full price. So I'll say for eight years, I really kind of treated this as a hobby. Like Jackie said, we got in together. We did a few things here and there, got to the first level of management. And I, I, did, I wasn't consistent at all. Um, I loved the products. I was consistent in shopping. I'll say that I shopped for my family every single month. And so I did consult for my family, but I didn't really offer this to everybody and I wasn't consistent about doing that. But I did believe in Arbonne. I mean, over the years, I've watched so many people pick up the business and do so well that finally, it was three years ago in January that I was like, okay, I really feel like I should do this, but I'm really scared because quite frankly, I don't want to be the scary Arbonne lady. <laughs> and, <laughs> I mean, you know the kind that you see in the grocery store and they're always trying to sell you something I was like I don't want to be that person because I truly do value relationship over product I value people over product um, I definitely believe in the product but that is not going to change relationship for me um, so the real shift came for me though when my husband sat down with me and and you have to understand at that time three years ago we were in a great place he was working for himself from home. I had had my second baby. I was homeschooling my oldest. I was sending my youngest to preschool because she's crazy. But uh, I, I sat down with my husband and he said to me, um, you know, I don't want to complain, but honestly, every time I sit down in front of my computer, I feel like my soul dies a little bit. And so when he said those words to me, I was like, I know I have to make a shift because I'm old enough now to realize that you can't just hope for something to change. You have to make a change if you want to get a change. And so I told him, I was like, well, I think I want to do Arbonne. And he's like, okay, great. But I don't think he knew it was coming. So, <laughs> But I'll just tell you that in two years' time, I went from a $200 paycheck to well over $5,000. And then the next year was almost $10,000 for the month. And I worked the same 15 hours a week. Um, by the end of this year, that'll double again to about $20,000 a month. And I have a business degree, and quite frankly, I've never made that kind of money ever in corporate America. And so especially in, you know, two to four years' time. So I just share that with you guys, not because I'm any kind of amazing. Well, I am amazing, but you know what I mean. <laughs> I mean, I'm not a unique type case. I just decided that I wanted something different and then I went after it. And so um, Jackie knows me. She's kind of watched my journey. And so there's been a lot of personal growth in the process, but it has been an awesome, amazing journey. And so Jackie wanted me to show my um, paychecks. Actually, I looked them up and I'll tell you that in January of 2013, that was my very first month. My paycheck was two hundred dollars and eighty-five cents. <laughs> I was like, "Yay, gas money!" <laughs> um, and then um, this past January, I looked up my paycheck. Wait, I gotta look it again. Um, it was oh, Jackie, I texted it to you, right? It was nine thousand four hundred and something. Um, nine thousand four hundred fifty-two dollars and twenty-three cents. Three years later to the month. Um, that's how my check grew. So I just share that with you guys because I realize that this isn't a fit for everybody. I'm not going to pretend that it is, but I do feel like it's worth looking at and just, you know, exploring the possibilities. If your heart is, you know, itching for just a little something different or a little something more, um, like Valerie, when she told me that she just decided to do something different and she wanted to do yoga, I was like, go girl. It's awesome when you feel like you can do something that you really love and it's even better when you get paid for it. So, <laughs> but anyways, um, so tonight I want to walk you through, I'm going to talk fast. So if you guys have questions, just alert me, but I'm going to walk through kind of quickly. I'm going to talk about a little bit about what Arbonne is. We're going to play in the product a little bit and then I'll show you how to shop at a discount. So one, two, three, that's it. 
So, okay, Jackie, first of all, did you hand out these guys? These little guys? I just did. Oh, perfect. Okay, yay. So hand those out. We'll talk about those at the very end. So you can set them aside for now. But all right, so let's, oh, here's my family. You guys want to see them? They're cute. Aww. I'm like, I don't know if you can see that very well, but <laughs> so there they are. I have two girls. They're 11 and four right now. So it's a busy time, busy time. So let's talk about Arbonne for just a minute. Um, so who in this crowd, I can't see everybody, but who's heard of Arbonne other than from Jackie? Anybody else? Yes, yes, good. Okay, so some yes. All right, awesome. Well, you, I hope that you've heard wonderful things. I trust that you have. <laughs> I know that Joan mm -hmm. is enjoying Arbonne. Mm -hmm. I remember talking to Joan a couple months back, so that's exciting. Mm -hmm. So as far as Arbonne, let's talk, I want to give you just a little bit of history and, you know, what sets us apart. So Arbonne is a health and wellness company. We were founded in 1980. So we've been around for 36 years now. This is our 36th anniversary, which is quite a long time for any business to be around. If you've ever, you know, looked at business and what it takes to start a business and maintain a business and to grow, we've been around for 36 years and we're still growing. So that's exciting. The word Arbon actually means beautiful tree, which is very fitting because all of our products start with plants. So we're the best of science and nature together. So we have always maintained maintain that motto of pure, safe, and beneficial. So every product, every ingredient has to be pure, safe, and beneficial. They actually have to work. So that's nice. Uh, so our products are made here in the United States, but we're formulated uh, with European standards. So I'll just tell you, I had no idea why that was important. I didn't even know what that meant when I first started using Arbonne. But in Europe, they've banned over 1,100 toxic chemical ingredients from personal care products. And anybody want to guess how many we've banned here in good old America? Anybody know? None. That's close, actually. <laughs> we've banned about 10 on that list. So, you know, anything that you see that's put out on the shelf, unless it's formulated to European standards, you always run that risk of having a lot of toxic ingredients in there. So I love that. Um, I love that we have that standard, you know, and so why does that even matter? I always laugh because when I lived in Oklahoma, you know, nobody really knew or cared. I moved to hippie Asheville and everybody's into everything clean and green, <laughs> but um, but yeah, so why does that matter? Your skin is your largest organ. So anything that you put on the outside of your body, any of your personal care products, cosmetics, hair care, all that kind of stuff, anything you put on the outside of your body is absorbed into your bloodstream, going to all your major organs in less than a minute. So, um, you know, you hear that you are what you eat, but I think it really needs to go one step further. You are what you absorb is really what the true thing is. So. So it does matter. I think that um, I'm kind of a researcher. When I first heard about Arbonne, I was like, I don't believe anything that girl told me. I'm going to go home and research all of it, which is actually true. I did. But uh, I didn't buy anything. Well, no, I bought a chapstick the first Arbonne party I went to. Hey! Yes, Angie. Angie! Hey. Hey. Angie's here. We can start the real party now. <laughs> Okay, so moving along. So yeah, I think um, it's important to know as far as toxic chemicals and things like that. I think we can all agree that cancer rates in America are skyrocketing, right? And so a lot of that is contributed to our diet. But I read a, a recent report that talked about they really believe the bigger factor is all of the things that um, where you, all of the ingredients that we're using in our personal care products, like our toothpaste, our shampoo, our lotion, our cosmetics, our deodorant, all of those things that we use every single day. And quite frankly, I didn't know that I should be reading those ingredients. And even if I did, I'm not a scientist, so I didn't really know what was good or bad. So it really does matter, um, you know, what you're using on the outside too. So. 
Okay, so let's, oh yeah, and you know what's crazy? Well, I think we may know this, but the FDA, they won't even touch personal care products. So there's no regulation whatsoever in America for personal care products. So that's something to think about. Um, okay, so let's move on. So all of our products are also gluten-free, which is becoming kind of a big deal for a lot of people. Uh, we're also 100% vegan certified. So what that means is, uh, just to give you a quick visual, which is kind of gross, but I, I didn't know this. I, I went home and looked it up. And so there's something called a rendering plant. In fact, I think there's one close to Tulsa. It's like Claremore, Coweta, one of those seas. I can't remember which one, but um, a rendering plant. It's an industrial plant. And if you've ever worked in a restaurant, you know, somebody will come and clean out the grease trap twice a week. All of that goes to the rendering plant. Um, it's expired meat from the supermarket goes to the rendering plant. Um, roadkill goes to the rendering plant. All of these things go to the rendering plant. And the number one buyer of the substance that comes out of there is American cosmetic companies. And technically that could be labeled all natural because it is, but that is probably not something that you want to be putting on your body or absorbing. So just to kind of, you know, put that in perspective, unless your product is labeled 100% vegan or vegan certified, chances are very high that there's something from a rendering plant, an animal byproduct that's made it into your product. So uh, we're also formulated without mineral oil. This is huge. I used to be uh, a user of Vaseline. That was my favorite thing. <laughs> All the Arvon people are like, gasping with horror but I'm like I'm still alive but anyway um, but yeah so mineral oil same thing that you put into your car it comes out of the ground black crude oil but it is the number one cheap filler for American personal care products so if you go home and you look at your bottles of lotion I did this if it says mineral oil petroleum petrolatum any of those ingredients in there that means that it's kind of like saran wrap. Nothing good can get in and nothing bad can get out. So even if the bottle of lotion says, you know, vitamin E, shea butter, blah, blah, blah. If mineral oil or petroleum or petrolatum is in there, none of those good things can get in and, and help your skin. So I don't know if you guys use the sea salt scrub. Did you do that, Jackie? Yeah. Yay. Okay. That's a perfect example. Um, yeah. It's not so, so that is like a classic example. So Arbonne only uses plant and seed oils, things that actually can soak in and work. So the sea salt scrub probably felt a little oily and greasy when you were using it, but I bet right now your hands are nice and soft and not greasy anymore. Yeah. And so all of those plant oils actually soaked in and did what they were supposed to do. So yay. But yeah, if you've ever went to um, a nail salon and got a pedicure, I'll just say I've done it a few times and who knows what they're using. It's probably, I don't know, but they put on those little pretend fake flip flops or whatever. And let me just tell you, your feet are so slick that you nearly, like you have to just hold on for dear life and pray that you can make it to your car because none of that oil is soaking in. It's probably mineral oil or petroleum, something like that. So that's a really good kind of visual that you can think of. So, okay, moving right along. Uh, we're also paraben free, which parabens are preservative. They give products a shelf life of 10 to 30 years. And I'll just tell you, parabens are linked to breast cancer and to hormone disruptor, their hormone disruptor. I did a little research on this. I always like to look outside of Arbonne to make sure I'm getting a non-biased opinion, but, but there was a, um, a study done with breast cancer tissue and 99% of breast cancer tissue was tested and they found parabens in breast cancer tissue and most deodorant on the market has parabens in it and that's something we're using right there in that sensitive area so that's just something to think about so we don't use that at all um, it's really hard to find products on the market here without parabens even some of the most popular baby products are loaded with parabens. Um, I was in the checkout line at Target the other day and there was a mascara sitting there and I turned it over and there were four different parabens on mascara. And I thought to myself, why in the world, you're supposed to change your mascara, what, every three to six months? 
why would you need a mascara that lasts 10 to 30 years? But the reality is, is they could make a whole bunch, put it in the warehouse, sell it to you 20 years later. Yeah. Uh, yeah, gross, right? But with Arbonne, even um, the makeup products and stuff, everything has an expiration date. So most of it's within two years. So you know that you need to use it because it's fresh. So there's that. So the best part is I really love this is that we, the products actually produce results. So, you know, I've been using Arbonne now for 11 years. I'm 70. It works amazing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, not really, but my birthday is this month and I'm turning 40, so. <laughs> and you guys get to see close up 70, you know, 72 inch screen. How does a almost 40 year old look? Yeah, it looks great. You know, you're ultra HD. Oh yeah. I, I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't ask this crowd with 72 inches. I don't know, but. Yeah. <laughs> um, anyways, but yeah, I mean, they really do produce results. We have a 45 day guarantee. So if you got something and you're not happy, you always have that option, you know, to return or exchange. So I feel like, I don't know, it's a no brainer. Why not? So, okay. So now we're going to try the products. Are you guys ready? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm excited. Can you tell? <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, we're going to sample the RE9 line. So. So before we start sampling, I'm going to tell you really quickly. Um, oh, yeah, this is kind of fun, too. These are all of our certifications right now. We are vegan, gluten-free. We're certified kosher. We've been screening for GMOs forever before it was popular. Um, and most recently, our sports nutrition line is certified by the Banned Substance Control Group, which is a pretty big deal if you're you know, an athlete at any level. You want to make sure that you're testing clean and using clean and safe products. So. That's kind of fun. So the RE9 line, this is our skincare line. I have it sitting here behind me. Voila. Voila. <laughs> Do you like that? I have it behind me too. I don't know if you can see that. Oh yes, yay, awesome. There it is. <laughs> so we're gonna sample the RE9 line tonight and we'll walk through it kind of quickly, but um, the this is our our flagship product in fact it's the most popular selling item that we have and Arvon has over 400 products so there's a lot to choose from but this is our most popular um, i always like to tell people it's not the only skincare line that we have but it's definitely the most popular it self adjusts to your skin type so whether you're oily or dry it'll self adjust to what you need plus it's anti-aging so Yay for that. Um, so this is kind of a fun little fact. Fact. Um, a lot of times you'll hear people say, oh, you just have good genetics, blah, 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 blah. But the reality is, is the aging process, genetics is only responsible for 10% of your aging. The other 90% is environment and how you take care of your skin. So this is kind of a fun example. Um, you have the 90-year-old monk, Obviously, not, not a lot of environment there. And then the 75-year-old Native American, a lot of environment. So just know that it's possible to handle your aging process a lot with your environment and what you're using. So, so that should be encouraging. Yay! <laughs> so I usually start with the... Um, the face wash, but we'll skip over that tonight because you guys are sitting there looking all beautiful. But we'll do, if you guys want to do this on your hand, that's fine. If you want to do your face, that's totally fine. That's up to you. But we'll start on your hand and we're going to start, Jackie did, um, did, let me start with here. Did Stacy give you these guys? Yes. Okay. So let me just talk to you for a minute about the Genius Pads. Well, first I'll, I'll mention this. So this is the face wash. I will tell you that this little bottle of three fluid ounces lasts me about eight months. And I wash my face morning and night. So because there's no filler in Arbon, everything in there actually does its job. You need like a pump, maybe a half a pump, and it washes all my makeup up, off everything. So there's the face wash. It'll cleanse without stripping. So then you come to this little guy. This is like magic. Yes. 
<laughs> so these are called genius pads because they're genius. Uh, and you want to try that on your hand or you can do your face, whatever. But these little guys are like the magic eraser. This is the only botanical retinoid product on the market in the world. So, so there's a lot of Retin-A out there, retinoid products, but they're all chemical based. So if you've ever seen somebody that has done, for instance, like um, a chemical peel or microdermabrasion, it's, you know, done with retinoids and all that kind of stuff, but it's chemical based. So their face is like what, peeling off? You'll see them like a day later. You're like, oh my gosh, what happened to you? Um, but these are a botanical version. So it's a lot more gentle. It's a skin resurfacing pad, so it does the same thing, but it doesn't peel your face off. So these are done at night. Um, it's for fine lines, wrinkles, age spots, sunspots, uh, basic large pores. It's for everything, basically. You need this. That's awesome. <laughs> but yeah, so there's that little guy. And then we'll go with the toner. Here's the toner, and Arvon does it in a mist. So you just need one or two little mists wherever you cleansed your face. And toner brings your skin back to pH. It also helps to reduce your pore size. So if you're smelling this, Jackie, you can pass it around. Um, you'll probably smell a little bit orangey flavor, like an orangey scent, because there is vitamin C in there. So it's kind of nice and fresh. So there's that guy. Then we'll go to them. Okay, so this little bottle of magicness. Which one's that one? This is the serum, intensive renewal serum. And this is probably, I would say, my favorite thing of the whole shebang because it gives intense moisture, it can erase scars, it lightens age spots, sunspots. It's awesome. And so, Definitely like the heavy hitter of the bunch. So there's this guy. And you'll probably notice, like Jackie, if you're giving him like a pump or a half a pump, yeah. a little goes a long ways. So just to know that this set, they, Arvon says three or four months, but it literally lasts me at least six months. So you can get a long time out of it. Mine doesn't last that long. I, I put it like on my elbows, <laughs> on my neck. Top You're of my bathing neck. in it. I know. <laughs> okay, so the next one is eye cream. And so there's two different ones. You could do this one or this one. This one is lifting and contouring, and this is the um, corrective eye cream. So I use, actually, I use them both. I use one in the morning, one at night, but you can you know, choose either or, but your eye cream, you want to, you want to do that with your ring finger and dab, 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 no rubbing and pulling, but dab, dab, dab. This will help with um, dark circles, fine lines, crow's feet, all that kind of stuff. So eye cream, eye cream. And you do want an eye cream. Um, your eye skin tends to be a lot more delicate than the rest of your face. So that's why we got a special eye cream. And then, is it feeling good? How are you guys doing? You look lovely. <laughs> Everyone's like, ooh, ah. Uh. You're so funny. <laughs> I love it. And so, and then we have a day cream and a night cream. And Jackie, I think you have the blue one, the lifting and contouring day cream. Mm -hmm. So the day cream, they have SPF in it. And so you can think of day cream as protecting. And the night cream's a little bit heavier and thicker. And so you can think night cream corrects. So protect and correct. So there you go. You can try that out. And even with the SPF, I know a lot of people are hesitant to use face cream with SPF in it because they think it's going to be greasy or heavy, but it's really light and nice and does the job. So there's that. Looking lovely, looking lovely. How are you guys feeling? Nice and, soft. nice and soft. Yes. I have to tell you, when I started 
what sold me was a sample of that product, that skincare line. I had never used skincare in my life ever, never, not once. And um, I tried the sample because it was a free sample. So I'm like, well, fine, I'll try it, free sample. But literally within three days, my husband, my sister, and my mother-in-law all were like, have you been doing something different? I was like, stop, did I look that bad? But, <laughs> but I mean, I could feel a difference. I mean, my skin felt amazing. I mean, soft and nice and, and glowing. And so I knew I wanted it. I was like, okay, I want this. <laughs> but anyway, so there is your RE9 line. Um, let me make sure I'm not missing out on anything. Okay. So I'm going to switch gears just a little bit. So I love that we have all of the skincare and all of the cosmetics and all of that stuff for the outside. But, you know, Arbonne focuses both on the inside and the outside. So they have the same standards, the same clean, you know, dirty dozen clean, 15, whatever. They have that same list for um, inside and outside. So we're going to shift gears just a little bit to the outside um, and talk about their nutrition line for a minute. So I'll be honest with you guys. I, uh, when I was first introduced to the nutrition line, I was like, okay, that's great and all, but um, I don't really need to lose weight. So, you know, this 30 day program, I don't know, whatever. But I did it because I was like, well, I want to be able to talk about it. And so my personal experience, I walked away from that. Um, I mean, I think I lost a couple pounds, but it wasn't anything major. But what I did walk away from it was my doctor had basically told me that I had the start of arthritis and my knees hurt all the time. And my body was like creaking and crackling. And I was in my thirties and I'm like, I've got little kids. I, it's really inconvenient to have that. <laughs> And, and to deal with that pain every day. But what I walked away from was I learned the foods that were, I, I learned that I could basically control my arthritis with my diet. So that was a big, big, big deal for me. I, I mean, huge. So if you've ever, um, I'm going to show you some pictures in just a minute, but if you've ever, if you've ever dealt with pain like that every single day or you know, that kind of thing. I mean, it really affects your whole life and it affects your mood, how you deal with people, how you deal with your family. If you're in pain, it's, it makes everybody a little bit grumpy. So, so that was a really big deal for me. So, um, but I'll just talk to you guys really quickly about our nutrition products. Jackie, are you passing out? Yeah. Okay, Jake's maybe, I don't know. I just, I just passed out the biscuit. Oh, good. Okay, perfect. Yay. <laughs> And then I'm going for the protein shake again. Okay, perfect. So we'll talk about this for a minute. So there is a 28-day program, well, technically 30-day program that Arbonne offers. And I love it because it's an easy way for people to plug in and understand. Basically, our goal is to educate and empower them so that at the end of the 28 days, they can learn what serves them and what doesn't. So you eliminate everything acidic, allergenic, and addictive for 30 days. And then you add them in one at a time, which is how I figured out that gluten was my trigger for joint pain. So, um, so it's a big, I, I love it because, you know, you buy your toolbox, which is sitting here behind me, you buy your little toolbox here, and then you're plugged into a private Facebook group, which every day they give you a little piece of education. Like for instance, one of the key components is balancing your blood sugar. So one day they'll just talk, a little bit about what it means to balance your blood, blood sugar and why that's important and what that looks like. Um, the next day they'll talk about why is it important to eat clean and organic and that kind of stuff. So there's a lot to it, um, but it's fed to you in bite-sized pieces. So um, I'm gonna walk through some of our the pieces to that puzzle. So one of them that Jackie just passed out was the Fizz Sticks. They're right here. They come in a box like this. They come um, in two flavors. They're citrus and pomegranate. And this is one of our family's favorite thing. I mean, if we start to run low, my husband gets a little bit anxious. <laughs> and so, but you have to understand, like, he came from drinking Starbucks every single day. 
Yeah. He drank a mocha every single day for I don't know how long since we lived in Seattle, Jackie. I mean, it was like three or four years. He drank one every single day. So let me just tell you, not only is that hard on the budget, but <laughs> he was packing on some pounds and he was feeling terrible. And so um, this is his substitute. This is an energy drink. Um, it's loaded with B vitamins. It has a little bit of caffeine. It's from green tea and guarana. So it's a natural based caffeine. I like to call it a mind clearing energy because it gives you a boost and it gives you like mental clarity, but without the crash that you feel if you drink like a soda or a monster drink or whatever. Um, so it is really, and it also helps to alkaline your body, which disease can't grow in an alkaline environment. So all kinds of good things there. So I don't know what flavor she gave you, but there's citrus and pomegranate. Um, the citrus is a little more tangy. The pomegranate's a little sweeter. So we like them both, you know, whatever. Um, the next one, oh yeah, also, um, I like that they are, where is it? I'm like looking at my notes. But they're only 13 calories per serving. So if you're drinking soda or a mocha, God forbid, that's not 13 calories. <laughs> a lot more. Oh, there's that factor too, if you're worried about that. Okay, so the next one is, I think she's coming out with maybe protein shakes, possibly. I mean, Joan could just stand up and give a testimony right now. <laughs> I'm not big on the chocolate. No? Well, that's okay. That is awesome. I've got my 23-year-old son drinking them. Awesome. Yay. Yeah. I love hearing that. That's totally fair. You know, vanilla is my favorite, too. So. Of course. But <laughs> he's not. But that's okay. <laughs> Well, the protein shakes function, um, you would substitute one or two meals a day for those. They're a meal replacement, but they are vegan. And so, I mean, there's a lot of protein on the market. I think you probably all are familiar with that, especially if you're at the gym. You're seeing all kinds of stuff come in and out. But I'll just quickly go over the difference here. Most protein on the market is whey-based which is an animal byproduct. In fact, whey used to be trash. <laughs> and then they figured out they could reprocess it and sell it, yay. Uh, but it is acidic and allergenic. So a lot of people that have dairy issues will have issues with whey protein. Um, it's also, you know, bodybuilders will take it to gain muscle. So it is not for weight loss. It is to bulk you up. And so if you're trying to lose weight, that is not the protein that you want. Um, so it does bulk you up. It is also, it's hard for your gut to process and digest. So just to kind of give you the idea, if you're taking 20 grams of um, animal protein versus 20 grams of vegetable protein, the animal protein in itself isn't really bad. It's, I mean, I, I still eat meat. Um, not as much as I used to, but I still eat it. I like it. But animal protein is a lot harder for your body to process. You only end up getting about 80% of that, or I'm sorry, 20 to 30% of that protein, whereas vegetable protein, you're getting 80 to 90%. Whoa. Um, 80 to 90% of that protein. So it's a lot easier for your body to process and digest um, vegetable protein. So that does matter. And our protein is a vegan blend of cranberry, brown rice, and yellow pea. And that combination is kind of magical because it gives you the full spectrum of amino acids, like what you would get from a steak, but it's vegetable protein. So um, the other protein on source on the market is soy. I think that everybody's starting to recognize that that is not a great choice because it definitely mimics estrogen in your body. And anytime you have soy more than once or twice a week, it starts to mess with your hormones. So that's a big deal. And, and most soy in America is actually genetically modified. So that's a, that's a big problem too. So that's just a quick overview. We have 20 grams of vegan protein, but not only that, it's loaded with vitamins and minerals. Uh, a lot of things I used to take separately, like um, for instance, CoQ10 enzyme. I used to take that separately, but that's in my shape. So I don't take it separately now. So yay for that. So I love them. They taste like a milkshake. My kids even like them. I mean, they ask for them. So that's how good they are. 
They also help to balance your blood sugar. <clears throat> so it's safe for diabetics to take them. That's a big deal too. So um, those are some things to think about. Are you trying to, you're testing them out? There's vanilla and there's chocolate. So and any myriad of combinations that you want to mix with that. Everybody's trying them. <laughs> I really like them. Uh, whey tends to be really chalky. So, you know, really not a great aftertaste if you're taking a whey protein. I like, I've, I don't, I've never used a lot of protein. I've had people come to me from all kinds of places and they're like, this is the best ever. So I'll just say that, but okay. Um, now, Bethany, I made those with water. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I didn't make them with, because uh, you make them with coconut milk, almond milk, white milk. Or you can put them in a little ninja and put some frozen fruit in it. And those, and they make them, those to me taste like bombs. Uh, yeah, chocolate yeah. shake with a banana. Oh, yeah. They're so good. So that was just, that was just a very generic, what you would taste. And you can tell the richness of the flavor that it has. And if you have it frozen with a, Mm -hmm. Almond milk is good. Yeah. My girls right. like it. Um, my girls will keep asking for chocolate with, I'll do almond milk in it and some ice and then a couple drips of peppermint essential oil. Mm -hmm. And it tastes like a thin mint Girl Scout cookie. <laughs> <laughs> I like thin mints. <laughs> yeah, they're really, really good. And I can even sneak stuff in there like they don't even know. I'll put spinach or the greens powder, and they don't even know. So, <laughs> yeah. I like, do the kids get the fiber and uh, the mm -hmm. digestive enzymes in their shake. Yeah, exactly. I mean, you can put all kinds of stuff in there, and they think they're having a milkshake. <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> So, so there's chocolate and vanilla. There's also um, a fiber boost, which is part of that program. Here's the fiber boost. It's also vegan. It's odorless, tasteless. I throw it in my shake. Most Americans don't even get half the amount of fiber they need in a day. And if you just got the right amount of fiber for a year, you'd be 10 pounds lighter. So think about that. Fiber is good. Keeps things moving. Keeps it going. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> Um, okay, so these are some of my favorite things. There's also an herbal detox tea. This little guy, it's very mild, caffeine-free, but it focuses on supporting your liver and your kidneys, which are the major detox organs for your body. So this is really important. Well, there's, there's, sorry, Bethany, hold on a second. Okay. There's one that's uh, caramel, and then there's a... Uh, in there somewhere. Oh, yeah, fit shoes. Woohoo! Yeah, yeah, there's a lot of different flavors. There's chocolate, lemon, caramel, vanilla, or I'm sorry, caramel, Coco Cabana, chocolate mint. Oh, Coco Cabana, that's right. That's what it was. Coco Cabana. And those are really great. They help to suppress your appetite and satiate you for a little longer. They also give you a little bit of energy boost. So if you're like me and you want to eat all the chocolate chips at 10 o'clock at night, just have a fit chew. <laughs> yes. What are they sweetened with? There is, I'm reading it right now. Um, let's see, there's a whole lot of things like, there's a whole lot of roots and root powder and all that. Uh, brown rice syrup is the main sweetener. So it, that brown rice syrup doesn't spike your blood sugar, which is a big deal. So there you go for that. Okay, so then the tea, I talked about that for a minute. Major little liver kidney supporter, you want that. That's a really big deal. I've learned a lot. There's actually an RN that um, comes to my meetings here local in Asheville, and she's been practicing for 35 years, I don't know. But she, t she was talking about how if people lose weight without detoxing or supporting their detox organs, that can be a big, big problem. Like things like autoimmune can spring up because all those toxins are still floating around in there and not being able to get out. So you want to, you know, weight loss should be a byproduct 
of detoxing, really. I mean, counting calories and just losing weight in itself isn't a great solution. You really want to do it a healthy way. So, in fact, Arbon really is picky. They're like, this is not a weight loss program. This is a getting healthy program. People end up losing weight. I mean, if you need to, you end up losing weight. But it's not a weight loss program. They, they don't want us to advertise that. So, um, this little guy is probably my favorite Arbon product ever. And if you're very acidic, it probably tastes terrible to you, but the more alkaline you get, the sweeter it gets. In fact, my four-year-old will take it straight out of the package. She loves it. I know, right? I see your face, Joan. <laughs> I know, right? Much. Yeah, I mean, the more acidic you are, the worse it tastes, but the better, the more alkaline you become, like by the end of the 28 days, people are like, oh, it actually tastes kind of sweet to me. And I'm like, I know, because your body is changing from acidic to alkaline now. But this is the only triple acting digestion product on the market anywhere. Um, it has prebiotics, probiotics, and 11 digestive enzymes. So gut health, I mean, that is the biggest thing. Um, whether you do anything else, <laughs> your gut health is the most important thing, and that affects everything. That affects um, skin conditions, things like psoriasis, eczema, like that kind of stuff. Um, it affects your mood. It affects your sexual health. It affects um, your sleep, your serotonin levels. All start in your gut. So this is a huge, huge magic little packet of goodness. <laughs> you like that? Yeah. Uh, and then the last thing is the seven day cleanse. And this is what well, you'll do this the third week. Let's see if I got one in here. Oh no, I got fist sticks in here. <laughs> They're downstairs because I'm in my Four. second week right now. <laughs> I know, I know that. the fist sticks, you know, one or two in my gym bag or in my purse, and I pick it up like, yes! I know, I'm hiding them. Yeah, here's the... My magic stash. Now, and don't you nurse on these all day long? So you mix it with um, 32 ounces of water. Is that right? Yeah, 32 ounces. And then, um, yeah, you take it all day long, you sip it slowly, but you do it on the third week, and it's kind of like a gentle scrub of your intestines, but... It's really like, I'm just going to put it out there. You're not parked on the pot because people are worried about that. Um, you can still function in your everyday life. You'll be okay. Can we exercise? Can we jump up and down? You do what? Can we exercise? Uh, yes, yes. You'll be good. You'll probably have to go number one a little more because you'll be drinking more liquid, but you'll be okay. But yeah, I love... <laughs> Aren't you glad you invited me, Jackie? I know. <laughs> Joan is loving all 72 inches of this. <laughs> You're doing awesome. awesome. Anyways, this is one that you'll do the third week. And we do it the third week because by, by that time, your body's got a lot of the toxins out, and you're ready to receive it a little bit better than if you did it the first week. So, so that's your little toolbox of goodness. Um, but the best part is, I mean, the Facebook group will give you recipes, a shopping list. I feel like we eat better and we save money when we actually do the program because we have a plan and we're not running out to eat stupid things and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> you know, Chick-fil-A and whatnot. But uh, just keeping it real, keeping it real, everybody. Okay. <laughs> So, oh, I want to show you some before and after pictures. I'm going to do this. I'm going to share my screen with you guys, and I'll talk through them really quickly. Hang on. I usually pass them around, but I'm not there, so we get to do 72 inches. Okay. So that is my favorite picture because that's my dad. Oh. And so he just did this program for the first time last month and he lost 20 pounds and he ran a 5k. I mean, this is something I've been waiting for for years, you guys. Huge, huge, huge. 
Um, in fact, he was pre-diabetic. His doctor was like, you have to do something or you're going on medicine. And my mom is a nurse. So she's been really like very concerned for several years and he would lose five pounds and then, you know, whatever, put it back on. But this is the most he's lost. I, I can't remember when he's been this thin. So I'm personally really excited about that picture. <laughs> Um, okay, so let's see here. Okay, this is my friend Jen. Um, she, this was the same photographer taken four years apart. So uh, the one that obviously looks younger and fresher was from August of 2015 after she had used Arbonne products for about two years. The other one was August 2011 and she was, you know, before her Arbonne days. So that is a huge change. Um, and then I know aging backwards. Uh, this is my friend Melinda. She's a preschool mom that my four year old goes to preschool with her daughter. And so this was her 30 or 28 day and then a year later, her pictures. And then um, this is Tonette from Home Office. She runs our multicultural events, but she had this is more than 30 days, but this is about a six month period that she's totally transformed herself and then oh this is my friend Rebecca we met in Japan when I was teaching English she has five babies and her husband's a lawyer he loves fizz sticks he drinks them before he goes into court <laughs> true story um, and so she's lost a lot of weight she told me today she's like I'm down to 130 pounds I haven't seen that weight in years so lover 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 and then this is my friend Gina so this was four years and counting. She's, you know, she went off blood pressure medications, off cholesterol medications. She has um, fibrocystic breast disease and that totally went away. Um, and that time she lost 69 pounds. So her life was obviously radically changed. And then this is my friend, Michelle. Um, I met her here in Asheville. Our daughters played soccer together. And so when I asked her to do this program, she was very, she's a scientist, so she was like uber skeptical, but she had tried everything else, other protein shakes, um, other exercise routines. Um, she did the Daniel fast, she went vegetarian, um, and nothing, she was having like six migraines a week, literally like not functioning well. And so in one month's time, her migraines resolved, and then she found out what her trigger was. <laughs> and now a year later, she's lost 30 pounds. So she's happy. And oh, this is another friend of Rebecca that I showed you earlier, a neighbor of his, of hers. And then, oh, this is Michelle's <laughs> husband that I just showed you with the migraines. He had actually been diagnosed with the big three, um, high cholesterol, high blood pressure, and diabetes. And his doctor was like, you have to do something. You have to do something. And so um, six months later, he went back to the doctor and did blood work. And the doctor is like, whatever you're doing, you need to keep doing it. I would have never guessed you're the same person. So he lost 35 pounds, going strong. That's their daughter, Michaela. She's our babysitter. We love her. She's a freshman in college, and she lost a ton of weight. She was having major health issues, too, so that was a big – you could imagine, you know, being 17, 18 and having an issue of weight like that. I mean, that was just killer. So that was, like, a huge boost of confidence for her. Bethany, how long was she on it? So she – I would say that's probably about six months. Wow. That's six months in. That is, that's rapid for six months. Yeah, that's awesome. So I know Michelle will tell her story. She was like, Michaela and I were exercising like six days a week. And she's like, a whole year went by using a different protein and everything. She's like, a year went by and I lost five pounds. She's like, to say I was discouraged is an understatement. So huge life change for their family. Um, this is another friend of mine. Her um, Kimberly actually lives in Tulsa, but this is her cousin. Um, so Kimberly asked her cousin to do it. She's been on for nine, for a whole year now, and you can see her results. And then, oh, my friend Angie. Yes, Angie. This was a year after she had her first baby, or her second baby. She's like, I still feel pregnant. I feel disgusting. So this was just in January. This was one month. She lost 16 pounds. Wow. 
And then my friend Chelsea lives here too. This was one month and she lost 15 and a half pounds in one month. She's actually down now 20 pounds and she's two months in. So I need to get an updated picture. That was like just this January and February. And then, oh, and my dad. <laughs> okay, so anyway, those are some before and after pictures. I like to share those because, I mean, they're real people. Like I said, it's not technically. Hey, Bethany. Um, yeah. I'm going to interrupt you real quick. I'm on 10% battery. I'm going to oh. switch. Up. I know. I got. <laughs> I'm going to switch you over to a, a charging port. Okay. okay. So keep talking. Okay. All right. So I'll leave you. I'll get you on the phone. Okay. Okay. Did you hear me? Yes, on the phone. Yeah. I'm almost done. Actually, that was pretty much all I got. But I'm gonna wrap up and show you guys how you can shop at a discount. Holla holla. <laughs> you guys have any questions for me? Anybody? Questions? I have one question about the um the fizz. What do we drink the the fizz? fizz. Yeah. What uh kind of Sweetener it is organic. Yeah, the sweetener is organic stevia leaf extract Perfect. and a little bit of organic pure cane sugar. Okay, so no artificial. No artificial stuff. Yeah, no. I don't think I mentioned that. No, there's no artificial flavors or sweeteners or anything like that in anything Arbonne. No artificial smells, colors, fragrances, sweeteners, flavors, none of that. So... So yeah, anything that you smelled tonight, like the sea salt scrub or the orangey smell in the skincare or that you tasted, um, it's all plant-based um, fragrance and taste and all that. So. I have a fun story to you, this is a question. But I was telling Jackie, I uh, was an Arbonne consultant like 14 years ago. Yeah. And they first came out with the RE9. Yeah, and I loved that, but I don't even remember why I stopped doing it. I think just because I started I was working and I had little kids and I just, you know. But anyway, they didn't have all this uh, nutrition stuff. And no, I, no. I, I love like I'm like pea protein, like the way the, the I'm like I'm all about what the ingredients are in these products. And, and you should be. It it matters. I did it a long time ago. So. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. I mean, the nutrition, that whole nutrition line came out, I think, maybe three years ago. I think when I was doing it, they came out with like the chews, and that was it. There was yeah. No, that, that was it. Right. The long, it was a long time ago. Yeah. Long time ago. When I first signed up, there was a different nutrition line, but it wasn't nutrition. It was like a weight loss thing. And they had a few things, but not, not anything yeah. like this. Very, very impressed with the ingredients and the everything on this. I'm on board. Yay! I'm excited. Good question. <laughs> good question slash testimony. I know. Good one. <laughs> oh, man. I know. It really has changed and improved. I feel like every year it gets better. Like, every year they come out with something new, like, um, two years ago, they came out with deodorant and toothpaste, and I was like, yes, finally, like, clean. I, I remember them giving a spiel, like, for, about deodorant, like, 14 years, but they didn't have, I didn't know they had, so now they have an alternative. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. It's, yeah. On my, it's on my order coming in. Yeah, and then last year, they came out with, they redid, um, well, they come, new stuff every year, but last year, it was the sports nutrition line was the big one. Um, and they have like pre-workout, during workout, after workout for that. And then um, they also redid all the sun care line, the sunscreen. So it's like all clean, all safe, all, you know, good for you, nothing bad. And the self-tanner is awesome, by the way. <laughs> Just saying. So, so I found one of my old self-tanners in the bottom of my file cabinet. <laughs> From a long time ago when I did it back, what, seven years ago? No. Years ago? And I'm, oh. I'm getting ready to lose you, Bethany. I'm going to have to switch you over to a, a, a port. Um, but I found it, and it hadn't been open or anything. I'm like, I wonder if this is still good. <laughs> I opened it up. It was rancid. I'm like, oh. It's natural. I know. Yeah. I mean, it yeah. smelled so bad. It was like, you know how when you smell olive oil, rancid mm -hmm. olive oil? Uh. 
Mm. Like expiration nice. date on everything. There's always an expiration date. Okay, you've got about probably about three minutes left. Three minutes. Oh, I gotta talk so fast. Okay. <laughs> Come on. Okay, so well, Jackie, you can even finish this out. But if you guys want to get out this little guy, um, and if you have a pen, we'll talk through it real fast. Well, there's, uh, yeah. Oh, you're going to miss all the good stuff. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> That's okay. We'll talk fast. So this little close, this um, order form here, if you look at it, a lot of times people will ask, you know, what do you recommend? What's your recommendation? So I put together three packages. Certainly you don't have to, you can pick and choose, but these are the most popular things and what people usually ask about. Um, the top one is a sample and save. So this is all assuming that you want to shop as a preferred client, which is kind of like, Sam's Club membership. Uh, the preferred client membership is kind of like a Sam's Club. You you get a discount all year. You can drop as much or as little as you want, but you get the discount and it comes straight to your door. You get online, you shop that way. So the top package is a sample and save. So you can pick a few things, for instance, um, a bag of protein powder, a sea salt scrub, maybe the day cream. You get your membership all year. You get some Arbon cash. That's a credit to your next order. You get a discount. You also, with that package, you get to pick a $50 free gift of your choice. So whatever you like, you get it. So the value of that package is $231, but if you want to write in the special price, is $140.80 plus your tax and shipping. So you can write that in there so you know. We're all about a discount or a pen. The middle packages, you'll see there's two of them, and those are probably the most popular because after something like this, people will either want skincare or nutrition. And so the skincare line is the look great. That's everything you tried tonight, all the pieces to that puzzle, plus your membership, plus you'll get an Arbon cash for your next purchase, plus a $50 free gift. So you'll look at that. That set that you guys tried tonight is actually the values. A little bit more because you use the blue one so the value of that's 541 but the actual price is two hundred and sixty four dollars and sixty cents for the skincare you'll even get the magic pads with that <laughs> the magic pad uh, the feel great package is all of the nutrition so two bags of protein powder two boxes of fizz sticks two bags of Fit Juice, two boxes of Detox Tea, the Fiber Boost, the Digestion Plus, and then the Seven Day Cleanse, plus your discount all year, plus your membership, um, your $30 Arbonne Cash, your $50 free gift. So the value is $542, but if you want to write in, the special price is actually $273, plus your tax and shipping. <coughs> And then the very bottom one is, yes, I want to get it all. That's, I, that's both packages together. So <clears throat> your membership all year, your $50 Arbonne cash, $50 free gift. The value is $980, and the special price is actually $523.80. <clears throat> so just so you know, um, yeah, I put those together because people always ask, you know, what's, what's, what do you recommend, yada, yada. But those are some great discounts. You can see that you don't have to pay full price. Yay, Arbon! Right up my alley. I'm like, discount all the way. So those are your options there. And then um, really quickly while we wrap up, I just want to hit fast on the business because I know Jackie mentioned uh, why she's doing this. But maybe this is too personal. I don't know if I should share this, Jackie. But, but she told they know everything. <laughs> but she told me the other day, she was like, you know, Bethany, the reality is, is everything that we had saved for our retirement when Michael got sick was gone in what, a year or two? Gone. She said, so we literally, like, what do you do? <laughs> so um, I just, oh, there she is. She's on her phone. Yay. But um, so that, I just want to say, like, this is something that, can give you that freedom or give you that second stream of income or potentially become your plan A. When I started, it was my plan B because my husband's job took care of everything, but he hasn't been able to get a contract in the last year and a half. And my paycheck 
has maintained our family's lifestyle for the last year and a half. So I just, I'm sharing that because I know that, um, I know it's not a fit for everybody, but it's definitely worth looking at. And so really quickly, before I finish, I'll tell you guys, um, you can see this. These are the four levels of management. You know, people always want to know how much money can you make in Arbonne? But there's four levels of management in Arbonne. And at the first level, district manager, um, you make anywhere between $200 to $1,000 a month, and that's working part-time. Most of my district managers that are working their business make about eight, $800 to $1,000 a month. Um, so that's a true, true story. $800 Oh, okay. Um, at the second level, area manager, anywhere between one to four thousand dollars a month, and at that point, your business becomes willable. So, if those people are still shopping in your network, I mean, God forbid, I don't make it home one night, my family will still get the thank you check from Arbon forever. So that's pretty awesome. I mean, Michael didn't offer that to me when I worked for him. I know. <laughs> Sorry about that. Baby. <laughs> Uh -oh. oh, we're getting a little feedback. Sorry. Are you guys okay? Yeah. Okay. Are you okay? I'm good. It might be because you have two devices. Yeah. You might have to shut the iPad off so we don't get a an echo. We'll lose your face. I think you'll still you still got me. I still see you guys. Yeah. Oh, yeah. you don't have me on there. Oh yeah, okay, never mind. Do you see yourself? Hi. <laughs> so funny. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Um, and then the third level is regional vice president, and that's where I'm at right now. Uh, the average income is anywhere between five thousand to ten thousand a month. You get an eight hundred dollar cash bonus for your white Mercedes, which I have, and you can have whatever one you want. Just has to have your name on it. And then and as, uh, the last one is National Vice President, and I will reach that by the end of this year. So in four years' time, um, I will have increased my paycheck from a $200 paycheck to about a $20,000 a month paycheck. Um, and so if I can do it, you can do it. Woohoo! Here you go. Yay. And I still work the same 15, 20 hours a week that I did when I started. So... It's a good, it's a good time to be in Arbonne. But um, anyway, so I'll wrap that up, you guys. If anybody has any questions, I would love to answer them. Anybody at all? Any more awesome questions? <laughs> nothing, nothing. Okay. Well, I am happy to, um, Jackie. Whatever you need from me. I can hang around if you want to call me back or anything like that. I can help you guys if you want to order tonight or anything like that. I can certainly help you get the best deal and walk through that. And then, oh, did we have a question? I don't know. So if you were to sign up to be a consultant, how much would that cost and then how much would that cost to get all this jazz? All that good stuff. So the, there is a couple consultant packages that we put together. They're not mandatory. The only thing that's required as a consultant is instead of $20 for a preferred client, you pay $79 for the year, but your discount bumps. Okay. And you get a $100 free product instead of a $50 one. So, so yeah, your discount bumps up from 20% to 35%, 35 to 50%. So you get a bigger discount. So yeah. Yeah, I know, right? We have a recent public request of three hundred and ninety thousand dollars. So that may or may not work. And this yeah. is to me, this is like that is just as much as a risk as a restaurant to me. But it's such a little amount to start your yeah. to start your own business for that type of income. We never make that kind of money at the restaurant. Girl, you no, know I didn't. I know I didn't. Do it. <laughs> I did not. Yeah. The only time I got to eat there is when I bought a car at Primo BMW. I didn't tell her. I was like, oh, I can't afford to eat the places, but I got a big store. <laughs> 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 
Well, I will say, I mean, a big thing for me that I, um, I looked at was, I mean, basically Arbonne pays you to do what you already do. Well, number one is, how you, well, I mean, basically what you do, we're word of mouth advertising. So instead of paying for advertising, like anything you buy off the shelf in Target or Walmart or the mall, they pay advertising. That's a lot of money. They also pay a lot of other things too. So we pay for that, but we get paid for that in Arbonne. We are the word of mouth advertisers, but we basically get paid to tell people, you know, to recommend product and to teach them how to change it, change what they're already using to something that's clean and safe. I mean, that's it. So, you know, somebody told me the other day, they're like, well, I don't, I'm not a good salesperson. I'm like, I don't like to sell. I don't like to sell at all. But the reality is, is you probably recommend stuff all the time. I mean, technically I sell vegetables to my kids every day. But when I, this is a great example too. Like when I worked at the restaurant, I recommended flavors all the time because it was the best restaurant in town. I mean, I really felt like it was. So I recommended it all the time. Did I get paid for that? No, I only made money when I waited tables. <laughs> I mean, that's what I made. And so, you know, you recommend a movie, you probably don't get paid for that. Um, you eat at a good place, you, get, you recommend it to all your friends, you don't get paid for that. You recommend a sale at Target, you don't get paid for that. I mean, shoot, if Target paid me, I'd be rich by now, but come on. <laughs> So yeah, I mean, it's if you actually believe in what this stands for, which I do, I mean, I feel like it's important that people, you know, whether they buy Arbonne or not, I think it's a really important to get people thinking about clean and safe, you know, not only what you're eating, but what you're using, personal care products, what you're using on your family, it matters. I feel like it really does matter in a major way. And so my job is just to put it out there. If they love it, great. I can show them how to get it at a discount. If they don't want to use it, no problem. I'm still friends. <laughs> so, but anyway, but yeah, you get paid to recommend something you already love and they are already, chances are people that you know are probably already spending about $150 a month on personal care products. What are you saying? I'm thinking chances are people are probably paying $150 a month on personal care, nutrition, all, I mean, they're already spending this kind of money anyway. Just change where they shop. That's it. Anyway, yes. Anything else, guys? No. You did just great, Bethany. Thank you so much. You're so welcome. Yes, you're welcome. Can you take a screenshot? Um, Can you do that on your recording? No, it's not on my computer, but I'm going to take a picture of it. Okay. But I got to show everybody here. Okay. You're coming this way. Okay. <laughs> Can you see us? Yes. Oh, yay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, hang on. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's good. Right here. Yeah. I can see Joan right up in the front. Okay. <laughs> Yay! Oh, good. I got it. Yeah. She is. She's so she funny. Is. Bethany, thank you so much for doing that for me. You're wonderful. You're, welcome. You're so welcome. Yes. Yep. If you need anything, I'll be around. So. Okay. I will. Thank you. Okay. Talk to you later. <laughs>